Hi there and welcome to anybody who's logged on through the website or anybody on YouTube who's uh, floating around. What I'd like to do is bring to you a uh, demonstration on an inflatable mattress from Multimat. This particular one is the All Seasons Trekker Compact. Um, an excellent piece of kit. It's an excellent entry level uh, inflatable mattress. So if you're in the cadets or you're vehicle born and you're not worried about the weight because it is a little bit heavier than the other uh, mattresses from Multimat. This particular one weighs in at 590 grams. It is worth consider considering purchasing this, this particular mattress. Um, talked about the weight, 590 grams. In respect to temperature range, it's minus 10 to plus 45 degrees C. So that's the mattress. As you can see, this is the three quarter length. And we've spoken a little about, about cadets and also the fact that if you're vehicle born and you're not worried about the weight, you could, um, it's certainly worth considering purchasing. Or if you're going on a camping trip and you want to purchase a mattress for your kids, definitely worth considering. So that's the mattress. What we're going to do now is going to cut and move to inflating the mattress and talk a little bit about that, a little bit about that and a little bit about the valve system on the mattress. Okay, moving on. As we say, we're going to talk a little bit about infl the inflation of the mattress and a little bit about the valve. Now one of the things that you'll notice when the mattress comes to you, it will be uh, sealed in a plastic bag. And when you take it out, you undo the valve and everybody says they're self-inflating mattresses and they just inflate. That's not the case. You need to blow it up first and then roll it up once you've obviously undone the valve, roll it up, expelling all the air, and then do the valve up, which is what we've done here. So this one has been inflated before. We've rolled it up, and now what we're gonna do is undo the valve. So, if we undo the valve, and then allow the mattress, as you can see there, it's now starting to try and inflate itself. Now obviously, if you move into a, into a position yeah, what you can do is you take out your mattress, undo the valve, and you allow this to inflate itself. Now, just one very, very important point. If you were using this in sub-zero temperatures, as, been, as has been pointed out by one of our viewers, make sure you allow your mattress to suck in as much air as possible before you blow into it. The reason why is that you obviously, when you expel air, it's moist. And if you're blowing moist, warm air into your mattress in a sub-zero temperature, there is a chance that that moist air is going to freeze inside your mattress. So if we were to leave this for a couple of minutes, it would almost fill itself completely up and then only require a few puffs of breath in order to inflate it properly. But we're gonna give it a hand. Now one of the things I did say is that we talked a little bit about the valve system on this. On the other multi-mats, the valve system is a little bit different. In other words, you can actually lock the valve on the other multi-mats to stop the air coming out. So you can push down, lock, take a deep breath, and then blow again. This one you don't, you undo it, you blow in it, and then you put your tongue on the end, do the valve up in order to lock it off. So give it a, a bit of a, a bit of blow. There you go. Three or four good puffs of air, bearing in mind that I didn't allow it to actually go to its full extent of self-inflation, yeah, and we're good to go. As I say, it's a level entry mattress, yeah, it's the all season Trekker series. This is the full length version. Obviously, what I've demonstrated applies to the compact version, so this demonstration will obviously be on the compact version as well. So thanks very much indeed for watching. You're after a, an entry level mattress, this is definitely well worth a consideration. Thanks for watching. 45. So who would use a mattress like this? Well, cadets, people in aircraft, cock. 